Okay, time for our top cover story, home automation. Now, you know, at one time, this used to be rocket science. Today, it's become really much simpler. But you can do very complex things with it, and that's what I'm going to demonstrate today. We're here in an area where I'm going to demonstrate almost four or five different kind of rooms, a lounge, a living room, a home theater like this, and very many different kind of things are also going to be demonstrated. And like I said, I'm going to do it all on one single iPad. Just with this iPad, I shall control it all. And the best part is most of it is not even needing any control. Once you're intelligent about it, for instance, I'm here in this home theater. The minute I press a single button, remember, it's watch, listen. That means music that can follow you, light control, comfort, like curtains and everything else. Everything is automated. For instance, I'll give you an example. Suppose you're in a home theater or even in your own bedroom and you want to watch TV. What all do you have to do? You have to either go and put on the lights or shut them to go and draw the curtain or open it. Then you have to go put on the TV, go to the right channel or go to your Blu-ray player or a movie streamer. In this, it's a single button. Press it. And when you press play, the lights will dim down, the curtains will actually close. It will go to the right channel. It will actually set the input right all will be automated. So here then is a demonstration, then I'll show you exactly how it works. All right, home automation, demo number one. Where am I? In a typical living room, right? I mean, you have a sofa, you have a nice lounge system out here. What do you not need? You don't need to see speakers, you don't need to see technology, wires, cables, but you still want television and music around, right? So how do you do it? You do it with home automation. Now watch, right in front of me is just a wooden cabinet and do you see any speakers at all? Nothing, but now watch the magic. I'm in the living room, I go into watch and I go into plasma television and see what's happening there. So I got you off started very easy with home automation, time to step it up to a whole new level. Now here's a room which in India almost all of us have, which is what? A hybrid room. It could be a study, it could be a lounge, it could be a TV room. Now I'm going to show you how you can make this one room into multiple rooms with the press of a button. So right now I'm here, a TV behind me, I'm watching TV, or you can see speakers out there, I'm listening to music or I could be reading. I can control almost everything, including the light for instance. I want the light to completely go off. I just press one button, it's gone. I want it to come back. I press two buttons out here, it's back again. So all I did was press a button, lights off, lights on. You can have scenes where you can have something which is a party scene, where all lights are working in a particular way, maybe a night scene where you only want a little bit of a romantic kind of a feel and music comes on. Those are easy. Here's the really amazing part. What if I want to change this place into a home theater? So remember, I've pressed only one button. What all is happening? The lights are actually going to dim out. The screen comes down, the projector fires, goes to the right input, and your movie starts. Watch this. So today has been a quick look at home automation at its simplest level, but remember, you can do very complex things with it automatically. Even more importantly, it's becoming easy, it's becoming very, very simple to execute, and it's becoming cheaper. So do take a look at if this is something you may want for your house. How does it work? How do the lights know how to go off when your television comes on? How does a projector know when it's on or off? How does it go to the right input? It's actually very simple. I'm going to try and quickly show you how that works. And remember, we will come back to this story again. And I'm going to take you through one of the most amazing home automation systems you can ever have. Enjoy the story. So now that you have seen the magic of home automation, what gives you the power to control your entire household with the touch of a button? Let's find out.
It all starts at the control for module, a very benign simple little box inside which beats the heart of all this complex wizardry. This is the box that talks to everything in your house. It all starts with an ethernet cable, the blue one that you can see going into the box here. This carries all the information to other lights, devices, curtains, projectors, screens etc. Everything is hooked up from here on the ethernet network as everything is on this as a mesh grid. One ethernet cable goes to your light box and the other to all your entertainment devices. Thus everything in your house becomes intelligent. The control for box then can be controlled with a custom remote, with wall switches or even with an app on your iPad or Android device through your Wi-Fi network. Your outdoor lights switch on automatically every day at 6pm, your curtains close every day in the evening and open in the morning, your TV goes to your favorite channel and your projector screen comes down all on its own. The future is here. India's number one news app just got even better. Download NDTV's new app, fully optimized for retina display, full screen view, faster response time, and Sudoku. NDTV's new iPad app. Download now.